the last time you and I mm -hmm. talked, we were talking, we, we ended up a conversation reflecting on New Jersey, boyhood days, adolescent days. Are those days anywhere in your life now with terrific success and movies and taxi? Well, Jersey's always in my life. I mean, I, um, uh, I have a friend out here now, Nicky Adio, who's a, a guy from Jersey who I grew up with. And, uh, you know, it's great to sit around and talk to him thinking of the old days, you know, and, uh, you know, uh, and I just went uh, recently to see Bruce Springsteen, great concert, what a great concert, mm. and uh, he's from Jersey, you know, I always think of Jersey, I think of those days, the boys, and I don't get a chance to hang like I did then, because that was what you did, you know, we hung around, we hung around the pool hall or went down to the boardwalk to look at the girls, they maybe pick one up if you're lucky. Uh, uh, does it you know, seem like a million years ago? It seems like a million. Does it and seem a, like somebody else's million, life? A million and a half years ago. No, no, no. It seems like my life. It's always with me. I carry it with me. Has Danny DeVito done the acting he really wants to do? Mm -mm. Has Danny DeVito started uh, to really get into it yet? Well, well I always do the acting that I want to do. You know, I mean, I always feel like this is the part that I wanted to play, or I want to play. Uh, uh, there's a lot more inside there, I'm sure. What's inside that hasn't come out, out in the roles that we've seen? It's, Taxi it's, and... It's like, you know, it's a rough thing to put your finger on because uh, each one is different, and uh, uh, I work off of an instinct of kind of, uh, uh, in an instinctive way, when I read something or talk to somebody about something that they're doing maybe I can contribute to or participate in. I, I find out of the material and, and out of the way I relate to the material what it's going to become. And so uh, it's hard to say. I, 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 I know that I'm eager, you know, to uh, keep going and keep digging and keep finding, and, you know, exploring. And, is the coming together of a cast of characters, let's say for Taxi or Romancing the Stone or Terms of Endearment, makes mm -hmm. no difference, or Johnny Dangerously, and then all of a sudden it's over and it ends. Oh, it's, it's, Does it's, that mean anything to you? Well, it means it's, uh, you know, it's horrible. I, mean, I hate that. I, you know, I, I mean, it's like a family breaking up. It happens to actors all the time. You know, we, we, uh, we always go through that, especially in a thing like Taxi where it was five years of the family and I, so what I miss about it most I don't miss going to work every day and trying to make the script work for that for the Friday night show but you never know what's right around the corner but there's lots of things around the corner what about Danny DeVito now as as father last as, time we talked Danny DeVito was just about to become father yeah Danny Danny DeVito as dad well it's fun it's great I love it she's 20 months old my daughter Lucy and uh, the biggest thing is to try to ke uh, keep it all uh, so that you can spend time with the, with the baby, with her. Do you? Yes. Uh, we just did the ratings game that I directed that she starred in with me. We kept Lucy on the set a lot. But is there it's a danger, terrific. Danny, of families coming unglued? a little bit apart? Not necessarily unglued because dad's got to work, mom's got to work. It's like any other business, I mean, in a way. I mean, you got... There are a lot of working parents these days, and uh, you know it's a struggle to be able to keep get that quality time with your kid. Uh, there's a danger of anything happening, you know, but uh, you you have to be dedicated to that, you know, goal to keep it all together to try to try to take that time when you're home with the baby or with your wife or with the family together to to make that important time. You know, it's, it's like really. Uh, it's like a guy who gets on a train every morning and goes to work. You know, he spends all day. He gets home at five, 7, 8 o'clock or whatever. I mean, my daughter, uh, I try to get home uh, to give her a bath, to feed her, be there at least while Rhea's feeding her, you know? And uh, then, like, that quiet time before they go to bed, you know, lay around on the bed, you know, maybe watch Winnie the Pooh or something that you taped or... You know, what did you do today? All now, are of that those stuff. important experiences for Danny DeVito? Very or when he's doing it, does he sometimes find his mind wandering back to Johnny Dangerously no, 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 or the ratings no. game? It's the opposite. It's the opposite? Yeah, it's the opposite. In I, the middle I, of the set, you're thinking I of the I find baby. my mind wandering to, 
you know, to to my daughter here. You know, I keep my, you know, my picture. I won't put it on television, but there's my, you know, I. That's this morning. She was putting a little puff, one of those little corn puffs in her mouth. So you find your mind going the other way. You know, you say like, how am I going to figure out? Let's make this work so that I can get. You know what I mean? <laughs> Let's go. And with directing was like, you know, it's an all consuming a uh, year and a half of my life here doing this uh, Showtime thing. Uh, and, uh, you know, you're there, it seemed like 24 hours a day. So I would get Rhea and, and Jill, who's our nanny, to bring the baby to me so that I could be with her. When I was mixing the movie the other day, at the, you know, last week, we're mixing it's this all day and all night. So a couple of times during the day, Lucy came down, we had a little picnic in the in the mixing studio, you know what I mean, that kind of thing. Danny, just to, to end where kind of we began, if you could bring back some of the past, some one of the past, some thing of the past, back from New Jersey, out here to California, and make it part of your life, what would it be? Uh, you know, I think it would be my father and mother and my two sisters, and when we were growing up, when I was growing up, there's this kind of like incredible tension in the house, you know, with, uh, you know, uh, lots of fighting and, like, crazy kind of, like, everybody, you know, my father was, like, this real strong uh, Italian man who was, like, you know, uh, ruled the family. And what I would bring back would be that. Uh, it's kind of strange, but uh, I feel that now as a mature adult, you know, I could help and make it, uh, you know, better. You know, there's some something about it that I missed when I was a kid. I always wanted to run away from it. You know, and I feel like if I just sat, you know, and looked at it and maybe analyzed it, I don't know or what, or maybe got through to it somehow, that I could contribute to its, like, resolvement. Do you know, it's kind of something that was there, and it's not there anymore, and, and I miss it. Thank you, Danny DeVito. All right.